The legal and political atmosphere in the country does not create conditions for an effective election campaign, said Chairman of Election Monitoring and Democratic Studies Center Anar Mehmedov at a press conference in IFS. He presented the second interim report jointly with the Public Association for International Cooperation of Volunteers. The report covered the campaign period from September 16th to October 6th. Mehmedov noted that the amendments to the election campaign in 2008 and 2010 led to a reduction of the election campaign term from 60 to 21 days, which limited participation of candidates, parties and observers in the electoral process. During the election campaign, editor of the newspaper Talishi Sado Hilal Mehmedov was sentenced and journalist Paris Hashimli was arrested. The campaign was characterized by the use of social networks to disseminate information about the elections, but the activists of social media were subjected to pressure. The campaign is held under unequal conditions, thus in many districts the candidates were provided with unfavorable venues for meeting with voters. Local authorities, police, municipalities intervened the campaign activities of opposition candidates. In 34 of districts, forced participation of citizens in activities to support President Ilham Aliyev was noted. Despite technical improvements, there are problems in the lists of voters. There were some cases where dead people were included in the lists, people who did internal emigration and those who did not vote in the previous election were excluded from the lists. CEC showed discrimination towards bodies seeking to exit polls. There are problems with the registration of independent observers. Thus, 100 observers trained by EMDSC were not granted accreditation, although the CEC announces registration of 40,000 observers. Most of these observers are representatives of local authorities and government agencies. The identity of 2,000 international observers causes doubts, as only 400 of them have been presented by serious international organizations like ODIHR, the OEC Parliamentary Assembly, the European Parliament and the PACE. Mehmedov also pointed out that the real active campaign was carried out in favor of Ilham Aliyev, Jamil Hassanli and Iqbal Agazada. The majority of the other candidates were technical and actually agitated in favor of the candidate of the ruling party. The content and timing of the presidential debates on public television did not meet the requirements of the voters. Of 24 nationwide and regional channels, only ITV gave airtime to candidates. At the same time, ITV refused to give Jamil Hassanli paid airtime. CEC has shown bias, passing a stern warning for Jamil Hassanli for the incident at a live debate and just a warning for Hafiz Hajiyev. In general, according to Mamadli, the political and legal climate in the country raises serious doubts that the vote on October the 9th will be free, fair and democratic. According to the head of the PAICV, Elnur Mehmedli, on the voting day, observers of this coalition will be monitoring 15% of polling stations in all regions. Recommendations of these NGOs put forth the need to create conditions for the smooth updating of voter lists to eliminate the pressure on voters, observers and representatives of candidates. The authorities should not intervene in the work of election commissions.